also known as Awesome Map Network. It's the it's the Awesome Map Network. Network, yeah, yeah. Math Network. Welcome back to the Mr. Donuts Awesome Math Network. Today we're going to be discussing some of the properties of exponents. This is like the fifth time I've cut this video, so if my voice is all over the place, it's because I'm having a good time now. Uh, properties of exponents. Suppose we are talking about the multiplying of exponents. In this instance, we have the base of x. We have x to the third power times x to the fourth power. We're going to keep the base of x. We're going to add those two exponents, 3 plus 4. And the final response will be x to the seventh power. That's what you do if you're multiplying. Suppose you're dividing. In this instance, we have a base of x. And we're being asked to divide x to the eighth power by x to the second power. We keep the base of x and we subtract 8 minus 2. 8 minus 2 is 6, which gives us a final response of x to the sixth power if you're dividing. What if you're raising a power to a power? Oh, power. So in the parentheses, you have x to the fifth power. And outside the parentheses, you have the exponent 3. You're going to keep the base of x and you're going to multiply 5 times 3. Again, these parentheses. We're going to take these two exponents, multiply, gives us x to the 15th power. Last but not least, in the event you have a negative exponent, a negative exponent can be uh, rewritten as a reciprocal. Here you have x to the negative 8th power. I want you to remember to rewrite that as 1 over x to the 8th. What we've done is taken that um, negative exponent, rewritten it as a positive, and put it under 1. That's the reciprocal. So there you have it. Those are just four instances of some of the laws or some of the properties of X. It's the Donuts Awesome Map Network. It's the, it's the Awesome Map Network. Network, yeah, yeah. Math Network.